Brett, thank you. Now new at 5, reaction from a student on board a Virginia Beach school bus involved in a nasty crash from this morning. 11 people, including 10 kids, were hospitalized after the accident on Independence Boulevard near JEB Little Creek. Police now say the bus driver is to blame. Ten on your side, Joe Fisher is outside the hospital where families are expressing some relief. We now know the bus driver is at fault in this crash. According to police, one student on board says the bus nearly tipped over, but luckily landed back on all of its wheels. The families I spoke with today say they are just thankful this wasn't any worse. It sounded like a dump truck had dumped its load in the back of the door had slammed. The impact could be heard throughout the neighborhood after police say a Virginia Beach school bus pulled out in front of a car while trying to cross Independence Boulevard with 34 students on board. I was talking to my friend and then um, I wasn't really looking but a car hit the bus and then I hit my head on the side of the window. Zakai Moultrie is a fourth grader at Shelton Park Elementary just down the road where the bus was headed. Everybody was screaming and yelling. Like other parents, Moultrie's mom frantically raced to the scene, but medics had already taken her son and seven other students to the ER for evaluation. I was freaking out. Like, my adrenaline was, like, I'm completely on a thousand. Police say an adult and three children in the Hyundai Sonata were also taken to the hospital with minor injuries. The car was done. The airbags, I mean, the car was bad. Troy Schauber says his son Jacob, also on the bus, had shortness of breath with some pain around his ribs, but an x-ray determined no broken bones. He said he was just scared. You know, it scared him, scared a lot of kids. A lot of kids were crying. Schauber says his son is in positive spirits, but now scared to ride the bus. He was a little shook up, but he did say he wanted to uh, become president, so whenever he did become president, he was going to put seatbelts on school buses. A brainstorming session inside the emergency room to prevent future injuries like his. And that bus driver was issued a citation for failing to yield, and the Virginia Beach City Public Schools has placed him on administrative leave. Coming up tonight on Wavy News 10 at 6, you're going to hear from a neighbor who wants the city to make some changes in order to make that intersection more safe for everyone. We'll see you in about an hour. In Virginia Beach, I'm Joe Fisher. 10 on your side.